a great honor. Um, I would like to thank the committee for selecting me. I'd like to thank those people that nominated me and wrote letters. It's a huge honor. A lot of men deserve this honor, and I greatly appreciate that. started back 35 years ago. I got involved in the Boone County United Way uh, and I worked my way up all the way to the president and campaign chairman of the Boone County United Way. We're standing at uh, North Arkansas Soccer Association soccer fields where I was inv heavily involved with coaching a lot of young adults in our area and that's been my passion for a long time. Oh, don't be afraid to say yes. You know, is if someone asks you to serve on their board, just say yes. I know it's scary. I've been there. And a great way to get started is a program that we have in our community called the Boone County Adult Leadership Class. Get involved in that. You'll have a network of people that you can work with, that you can volunteer with, and just step your foot in the door. Don't be afraid to say yes. If someone doesn't ask you to serve, volunteer to serve, get involved. I promise you, you'll get more reward back for what you do if you just volunteer. I've gotten involved in different things, you know, like I've gotten involved, like now I'm heavily involved with the school board. I'm the vice president of the school board. I'm heavily involved with the chamber. I'm the chairman of the chamber foundation. You know, I think I've kind of just been very diverse in what I've gotten involved in. You know, I was the president of the Harrison Country Club Board of Directors for five years. I think regardless of what you get involved in, if you go from one organization to another, they're all different. And so you've got to adapt to the needs of that organization. And I think if you'll adapt to the needs of that organization, do everything you can to make it better, you'll be successful. Well, my passion for all organizations, including youth, is, you know, I want to see young adults succeed, not only on the soccer field or the basketball court, but I want to see them succeed in life. And I've always said that, you know, any board that I get on or serve on, I want people to say that when Mark Martin's term is over, that that board has made strides in the right direction and became a better organization than they were when I started. Well, you know, it obviously starts with my mom and dad. They always taught me to do the right thing and help others. And I couldn't serve on these boards that I serve on if it wasn't without the support of my lovely wife, Debbie, who allows me to be away from home at times. But a guy named David Evans, when I went to work for Arkansas Power and Light 35 years ago, said, hey, you need to get involved in the community. And he got me involved in Boone County United Way. And then he also got me involved in officiating high school football which we've talked about and turned into a very long career where I officiated for over 35 years and was inducted into the Arkansas Officials Association Hall of Fame three years ago. And David mentored me throughout my career with APNL and Energy and kept me involved in the community and I couldn't have done the things that I've done without his support. I've always tried, again, like I said, to volunteer, um, help others, um, try to make the church a better place. You know, um, I've been a deacon at First Christian Church, and so I've always tried to volunteer at church and help, you know, when we have cookouts and things like that. Just anything I can do to make things better, that's what I'm trying to do.